males lose theirs around November. At, reproductively active males lose theirs in November. Uh, younger males will lose theirs beginning of February, and the females again in the March, beginning of April, they should lose their own. And these are Eurasian reindeer. We have reindeer in North America. We call them caribou. Caribou and reindeer are the same species. If you live in North America, you call uh, captive or domesticated caribou reindeer, and wild ones are caribou. And if you live in Europe or Asia, rain, wild reindeer and domesticated reindeer. Other than that, they're pretty similar. Uh, what's the natural predators are to reindeers? Natural predators for reindeers can be things like wolves and polar bears. Uh, I guess a cougar could try. They have a little bit of Wolverines? Wolverines sometimes will go after. What about orcas? Orcas? Actually, yeah, this is interesting. Reindeer are really good swimmers. Uh, they have a really thick coat. It's about that thick. And uh, the inner coat is really thick and fuzzy, keeps them warm. The outer coat is like a polar bear. Bird, uh, goat, birds of prey? Uh, sometimes an eagle. You know, a golden eagle what about a tiger? Uh, tigers and reindeers don't live in the same time. So reindeer are really good swimmers because their coat is so thick and warm and full of air pockets. It actually acts like a life jacket. They do swim quite a bit, a lot more than other deer species. And at that point, an orca could get a reindeer. Probably not very what about green sharks? Uh, Greenland sharks? I don't, I'm not that familiar with shark species to know which ones. What's the average reindeer. lifespan of reindeer? Uh, females in the wild can live up to their late teens. Uh, males about five years shorter than that. So well, uh, the, the diet? The diet, they eat a lot of grasses and um, browse and leaves when they can. The really interesting thing about reindeer is they're one of the only mammals that can eat lichens. They have a special enzyme in their gut that can break down lichens that most other mammal species don't have. So through the winter, when there's a lot of snow on the ground and plants aren't does really growing, does caribou migrate? Uh, depends on the type of caribou. There are 13 different subspecies of caribou. Some barely migrate at all. Those tend to live in woody areas. And then there's some subspecies that can migrate over 3,000 miles, maybe up to 5,000 miles a year. Just like wildebees and flamingos. Yeah. And walruses. A lot of variation in the different subspecies of caribou or reindeer. Uh, some are pretty small, weigh maybe 100, 150 pounds. Some are very large, and the big males can get up to 700 pounds. 